One tip that I have for how to approach class or course planning, particularly for an active and discussion-centered class, is one that wasn't even on my radar as something that one would do in my first few years of teaching. And it's this. Plan not just the content that you want to cover and the learning goals that you want students to meet at the end of your class, but also how students are going to engage with the content and with each other in your class. You might think about things like is this a question where students should think or write quietly before they talk to a neighbor? Are you gonna ask every group to share their ideas or conclusions with the whole class at the end of some discussion time? Um, or are you going to ask for a couple of questions from the class after a small group discussion? Are you gonna ask for some deliverable from each student or each group at the end of the period? And I think thinking about this kind of thing ahead of time can help you to clarify your expectations for students and clarify the structure of your class. And it can help you plan for a variety of different ways that students can engage with the material and with each other. Um, you can also plan ways to communicate to students what you want them to do. This might be something like using little icons on your slides. I always think of the all play cards in Pictionary, you know by the color and the little picture on there that this is around where everyone should be participating. Um, or you might talk about what you expect for group work on the first day. You would tell them kind of here are some different ways I might ask you to participate in class, that kind of thing. Uh, for example, I just use different colors on my slides to indicate to students whether this question is something like a shouted out whole class discussion kind of question or a talk with your group and come to consensus kind of question or a think about this quietly by yourself before discussing kind of question. I think that having a variety and a plan for different like group work rules you might call them can give you and also LA's learning assistance or teaching assistance if your class is supported by those people. Um, it can give you more to work with when you have groups that just aren't working well together and you feel like you need to intervene to help them collaborate successfully.